Welcome to the Dazwell Beats channel. I'm Dazwell Beats. Today we'll be doing some of my subscribers is having issues with installing VSTs inside the MPC software. So today that's what we're gonna do. Akai just released the soft clipper. I went ahead and purchased it and I was like, you know what? Let me make a video showing y'all how to install the VSTs inside the MPC software. Alright. Well, the ones that's from Akai and the Air Music. Alright, so let's go. That's what we're doing today. How to install the soft clipper. Alright, let's go. Let's get it. Once you open up your browser, you go to Akai Pro. That's what your, your automatic thinking will go to Akai Pro, right? But you won't find the soft clipper inside here, right? So what you need to do is scroll down to the bottom and right here, you click the air. All right. So now we are air music. And um, once you scroll down, it's the first thing on the site right here, the soft clipper, right? You'll go ahead, you'll click it. It's $19.99 with tax, depending on where you live. I think it's like 21 something. All right. So go ahead. You can try for free if you want to, or you can add it to the cart. So you'll add it to the cart. Go ahead and pay for it however you want to pay for it. You think you can use debit card, PayPal, and all the other stuff, right? So you can go ahead and pay for that. Once you pay for it, it, it will actually it will say thank you for purchasing such and such. And then it will say, do you want to download? or continue what you want to do you don't have to download it right away you can just hit continue all right once you hit continue make sure before you purchase right make sure you use the email account that's associated with your mpc software any email account that you use for all your software instrument make sure you use that email because you got to go to your product page with that email because it's registered to that email and then you can install it from there all right so make sure you know what that email is if you have several emails just make sure you use the email that's associated with your in music account all right now once you do that you hit continue you don't have to do it'll ask you if you want to install go ahead and install the um what is it called the in music software all right and once you install the in music software and you open it up this is what it looked like right here all right so right here is where you at you'll scroll down to the bottom and you'll see the soft clipper right here right deactivated that's after you purchase it so what you want to do is hit download let it download then you'll hit install All right, this popped up. I normally uncheck the VST3 because that's if you use it other DAWs like um, FL Studio or Ableton or any other, you know, any other DAW. So I normally just get rid of the VST3, let it install the VST and get rid of the AX, right? And then I will hit next and I will hit install. finish that's it all right now open up our mpc you go right here to file edit preference activation let's make sure it's activated soft clipper yes is already there now right so now let's try to open it up Let's just search for it. Uh, soft clipper. Right here. There you go. All right. So that was just a real quick video, man, to show you how to install the Air Music VST soft clipper. And that's it. All right. We're going to be using it, testing it out. I don't really, I don't think I really needed it because I didn't really use soft clippers as much. I used the, um, what was it called? Little clipper or something like that. But this 
I normally put soft clippers on my drums and inside the um, drum program you have a soft clipper inside the effects already so I just went ahead and grabbed it we can use it somewhere all right so let's go man let's get it as always thank y'all for watching thank y'all for subscribing thank y'all for everything man I appreciate it let's go let's get it catch you in the next one turn it up let's go